What's up guys, today we're going to be opening up an epic package that has some pretty awesome cards in it. There is some epic Legend of Blue Eyes cards and some other things, so before we get started, the giveaway. I'll be giving away the three Sphinxes. We pulled these out of the exclusive pack we opened on video in the mail day. Make sure you guys go check that one out. It was a pretty fun mail day. We had that crazy LOB pack, which may or may not be resealed. But let's go ahead and crack into this. It's going to be pretty awesome. All you got to do at the end of the giveaway is like this video, be subscribed, and let me know your favorite card from this box. So here we go. Let's open it up. Let's see what's inside. Some pretty epic stuff. If this is what I think it is, which may or may not be. We have Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Check out. <laughs> check this uh, plastic bag out. This is going to be pretty interesting. Okay. Let's see what we got out of here. So it's not too many cards. This is not going to be too long of a video. But I wanted you guys to see this because there's some pretty cool stuff. Potentially stuff that we will grade. So that's right there. Let's see what we got. We have a Dragon Capture Jar from LOB First Edition. Let's check out the condition. Very minty. I mean, it looks great. I mean, there's a tiny bit of scuffing on the back, but it's like pack scuffing. So it's like not too like bad. I mean, that's just what it's going to look like even out of the booster pack, which by the way, LOB First Edition, we may or may not be opening some packs soon for 40K. I know we're way past 40K. My bad. Thank you guys, by the way, past 40K. That's awesome. But, um, <laughs> but yeah, we're going to be opening up some cool stuff for 40K, even though we're past it. Hope you guys enjoy that champion back to that early 40K video. So you guys can check that one out. If you didn't, that was an awesome video. Flame goes. So we've got some really nice conditions on these first edition lob rares. First edition lob. I was about to say first edition lob, first edition. <laughs> really want to emphasize the first edition here. Okay. So yeah, there we go. Hain Hain. Yeah, if you guys didn't see when we opened the first edition booster pack, make sure you guys check it out. I saw that, um, I heard that someone else opened one, a first edition booster pack. That's what I heard. And it was me. That was, I was the one who did it. So Spirit of the Heart, pretty nice, yeah. So all my rares that I got in that big 10K collection, they had, let me show you guys this. Let me see if I can see it. Okay, do you see, okay, let me see if I can get it. That that line, you see that line? It's like not an imprint, it's not like an actual like line, it's just like, I don't even know how to describe it, but if you guys can see it, it's almost like, just a little wax. I don't know what that is, but it's just a line, but it's on all, like, almost all the rares that I have, which is super weird. I guess they came out a lot like that. Oh man, pot of greed. This is a pretty nice one. Wow, that's in pretty good condition. The front centering is not too good on it, but that's okay and that's still pretty cool. All right, so maybe we won't go through all the rares like that. Maybe we'll just, you know, they, they all are about the same condition, it looks like. So we got Final Flame. We're not going to go through every single one. Oh, here we go. We're going to look at this one. First Edition Hollow Trap Hole. Let's see what the condition is. Wow. That is pretty nice. That one is going to get graded. Even if it gets a 9. I actually do have a 10, but it's in, like, horrible condition. I was actually giving it, but... to. It was given to me by a friend. It was pretty cool, so that was nice of him. Even though he's always memeing on my channel, so uh, <laughs> so yeah, I still appreciate it though. Yeah, all right, here we go. Ooh, that's cool. Premium pack two. That's nice. Oh, a god card. Okay, this one looks kind of beat up. Oh, this is just the uh, Yugi's legendary decks, but still cool. Still cool to have a god card. Blackwing full armor master. See, this is just like complete random stuff. Let's go. Oh. What? <laughs> Speaking of, that's not random. That's a first edition secret rare from Legend of Blue Eyes. So I, every time I pick up multiple, I end up on that. So let's see what we got. Oh, do we have a binder ding? No! <laughs> Why? We're cursed by the binder dings. Oh my gosh, that is so sad. Man, every time I get a nice card, it seems like it has a binder ding. Well, that's a cool card. Um, that's pretty sad. <laughs> it has a ding. We are getting killed by these binder dings. All right, on to the next thing. Let's see what we have. Oh, Dark Necrofear, that's cool. First edition, no sleeve. Oh, there's a little nix at the top. Still pretty good condition. Maybe like light play because of those nicks. Maybe very light play, I don't know. Probably not very light play. Still a nice Labyrinth of Nightmare card, that's pretty cool. Oh, I forgot to show you guys these because I saw the uh, saw the Trihorn. So we have Solemn Strike Seeker Rare, that's cool. Millennium Eyes Restrict and Blue Eyes White Dragon. This one's a little beat up. 
That's still really cool. I mean, that one is not in good condition, but that's still cool. Okay, so what's in here? I thought it was the Trihorn. It's an Allure of Darkness is in here. Okay, that's weird. Let's see if we can get that out. That's from Raging Battle Special Edition. Is that right? No, that's from... Uh, that's from the uh, Dark Seer. No, what is that called? The uh, Destiny Soldiers. Yeah. I opened that up a long time ago. I think on the channel, actually. Prentice Illusion. That's pretty cool. Sage of Eyes of Blue. Blue Eyes Alternatives. Those are nice. And Upstarts. Okay. Pretty cool cards. What else do we got? Ooh, Secret Rare Genzo. Blue Eyes. That's something. It's still worth a few bucks. Let's see what the Secret Rare Genzo. It's a BPT version. It's not Pharaoh's Servant. Bruh. Ooh, is that a reverse? That's a reverse. Nice. Reverse Jinzo. And look at the centering. That's like almost a misprint with how bad it is. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. It has a binder ding as well. Reverse foil B or PSV. That's not BBT. PSV. Reverse foil PSV Jinzo with huge centering problem. That's actually really cool. It might be the thumbnail. That's sick. Yeah, that's super sick. Wow. Alright, so that's a nice that's a nice card. What else we got? We got some super rares. Anything good on these supers? There's a no oh, two dark magician. That's not bad. Uh, Mega Phantom Beast. We got a uh, Dragoon D. Fairy's Gift is really cool. Mahavilo, Magic Hand, Gravekeeper's Chief. That's old school. Triple Star Tryon, Ultimate Creature of Destruction. This card was worth like twenty dollars. I think it got reprinted in Legendary Duelist, or maybe it's about to. I don't know. Still worth a decent amount, I think. All right, and finally we have Bubble Shuffle, Cannon Soldier, Dark Lord Nastin, okay, big man shot, Brick of the Magical Warrior, Gishki, Gishki Shadow, Dark Eradicator Warlock, and Ascending Soul. Okay, so there's a lot of cool stuff in there. I mean, overall, I mean, it's pretty good. Pretty good lot. We got some first edition LOB cards. The rares look really good. The trap hole looks really good. Unfortunately, the Triorn thought it was going to look good, and it has a binder ding, so it's like a five, but oh well. That looks really good, so maybe we can get another 10 on our trap hole. Also, I sent in that express sub, guys, and it's at PSA. It finally did make it. It got delayed, but hopefully it'll be back in like a couple of weeks and we can do those like Dark Magician Girl and the blue eyes I sent in, even though I had a ding, Dark Magician, all that cool stuff. So it's going to be crazy. Let's just flip through what we got. That's one of the coolest cards we picked up. Alternatives, Upstart, Blue Eyes, White Dragon. I mean, there's some really cool stuff, and a lot of this will be for sale. The rares, I'm probably going to grade those, probably going to grade the LOBs. Um, but other than that, I don't know about this. So I'm going to keep this. But let me know if you guys are interested. And I appreciate you guys watching. This is a shorter video, but I hope you guys did enjoy it all the same. So I'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh! Yes. Oh, Elemental Hero Dark Bright. Boom! Oh! <laughs>